Hi, this is Alex from VPEstate.org development team, and today I will show you what's new in VP Residence 3.1 real estate team. So, the first feature I will show you in this video is the property model Zillow style. Let me show you what it's about. So, if you go to Zillow.com, you all know the giant real estate website. And if you go on their property list, on the half up list, you'll see that you have the properties on the right. And if you click one property, a model will open a window or a pop up. Let's say it's a pop up if it's not too technical. And you have all the details here. You have uh, status, home value, et cetera, et cetera, gallery. You will be able to contact agents. And basically, you have all the details here in this model. So we did the same thing for WP Residence. And uh, to activate this feature, just go into Theme Admin, go into Design section on a property list and make sure you have this open this option activated put it to yes so click and open property model window zero style have this to yes and if you click yes and uh, we have here on our demo site a property list if you click on uh, one property it will open in the same in the similar way like on zero and you have all the info here and the gallery and you can navigate through pictures and uh, if you want to see it on our main site on my on our main demo i mean you go to uh, list zero style you have it here and uh, here on the main demo page you have uh, the model with many more details so you have agent address details uh, feature amenities with icons, Yelp, walk or floor plans, maps, payment calculator, basically everything you need to have a successful real estate website. And you can browse the gallery also. We have only three pictures for this uh, property, but I think it's enough. We have the share, add to favorite, contact agent. So everything you need for a successful website. So the second thing I want to show you in this video, it's the new features we have for feature and amenities. Uh, there are actually two features. If you go, and I will show you in a moment, if you go to one of our properties, let's say New York Studio Apartment, I have it open here. You will see that for each feature, we have an icon, like look for like for kitchen or media room. And uh, um, they are split in categories. So you can group them uh, for like interior details, outdoor details, utilities, etc. So let me show you uh, how we, this can be achieved. You go to properties, not mean. You go to feature and amenities. Okay. And for example, let's take the kitchen, the equipped kitchen feature. And you see if you, you can attach it to a parent category. In, the, in our case, it's interior details. We can go to, our, I don't know, to utilities. But for, for this demo, it's in interior details. So just attach it to a parent category. And the, the feature will go under it. So equipment feature will go under interior details. And just upload a SVG icon here. You have here the video, upload it. Ignore this Yoast CO, click update, save, and that's it. You have a feature and amenities with icons and split by category. Okay, guys, the next thing I want to show you is the sticky sidebar for property page. To activate this option, is just go into theme admin, go into design, property page settings, and you have here use sticky sidebar on property page. Click this to yes save and you can see the list the sticky sidebar here here is the link agent on sidebar and this is how it's actually look and how it's actually behave when you scroll the uh, uh, agent card will always remain uh, in that position no matter what you do use it when you want to agent contact form and agent details to be visible on all times 
Okay, the next thing I want to show you, it's a new property card we develop for this update. It's called property card type 5, and you can activate it if you go in uh, team options, design, uh, property, agent, block list design, select here type 5, this is unit you know, card type, save changes, and here is how it looks on our main demo. As you can show it, as you can see it, it's an elegant for your card and you can uh, use it in various combination and uh, so far people love it. So I hope you enjoy it. Another thing I want to show you, it's our uh, latest widget. We call it the uh, full map with listing. You can see it on our main demo here. It's basically a Google map or an open street map with all the listings you have. And uh, to add it, just click edit page and we will open our showing Elementor. You have it down here. If you click edit, you can see uh, you have several options like map height or list of categories, list of action categories, city area, etc. etc. Just add it like any other Elementor widget. So this is it. This, these are the main features we release in 3.1. We hope you enjoy it. We want to especially thank you to all the clients we have. And if you like this update, maybe you're going to become the, our client. And uh, we're already working on 3.2 when we have some very nice surprises for you guys. Take care.